Most parts need more than one setup to be manufactured, increasing the complexity and the time needed to complete the CAM programming task. Each of these individual setups may also require different clearance parameters to avoid fixturing components such as clamps or may benefit from a certain method for cycle time efficiency. All of these different setup values can increase the opportunities where programming errors could possibly occur. PowerMill 2023.1 now simplifies this process with the addition of connection moves to the setup form. Using this part, which has three different setups on a tombstone as an example, we can see how connections can help. Let's activate setup one and open the settings. We can see a new setting for connections. By selecting the edit setup icon, the connection form opens. We can see that safe area clearances and the start and end points are available to be defined. Leads, links, and point distribution are grayed out as they are set in each individual toolpath. Note that in this setup, we are using safe plane connections. Let's now activate setup two and review the same settings where we can see the safe area type is set to cylinder links. Opening the form for the spot drill toolpath and looking at the rapid move settings, notice that the settings have been replaced with the use setup connection option. By unchecking this, connections can be changed independently from the setup. The same option is included in the start and end point. You will also see this option when accessing them from the toolpath connections on the ribbon. When creating a new toolpath, the connection moves for the active setup are automatically applied to the settings, reducing the opportunity of selecting the wrong clearance settings needed for the setup. Activating setup one again, we can see that it contains three toolpaths. As the connections are assigned to the setup, when a change is made, it is global, and all the toolpaths contained within the setup are automatically updated. Opening the settings and the connections, we can see these are currently set to use a 10 millimeter rapid plane height. Let's change this to 100 millimeter and apply it. By activating the three toolpaths, we can see the links have been updated. Now, if we activate the toolpaths in the other setups, we can see that they have not been updated. One additional change to setup behavior has been updated as well for safety. If a toolpath is created without being assigned to a setup, then is added to one, is automatically invalidated as it cannot be verified if the correct clamps have been selected during its creation. This also happens if the toolpath is removed from a setup. The addition of connection moves to machining setups on PowerMill 2023.1 reduces the time needed and increases safety, giving you greater confidence in the CAM programming of complex multi-setup parts.